Hello everybody, and welcome back to my office. It's time for another review. This time Creality sent me one of their lasers. The Sierra Laser Falcon, 10 watt. Now doing the last laser review made me pretty interested in these things. They're a lot of fun. This one is a couple hundred dollars less than the other one, a little bit less capable. But with this one, they sent me uh, that honeycomb screen that you saw. You use that for laser cutting. And this is the air assist, also for use with uh, laser cutting. I'll show you uh, examples of that later in the video. And this is the laser itself. Again, very nicely packed, nice and tight, secure. I'd say you could drop this box and uh, not damage anything on the inside. This one comes with legs. That green uh, set of glasses right there is for your eye protection. And I'll talk more about this uh, button control later in the video. And I will say it was a little bit easier to set up than the last one I did. It took me about 20 minutes. And instead of the little swing arm that you saw on the previous laser engraver, this one comes with this little plate that has uh, steps on it for different uh, thicknesses of the wood. This is a G-code file that was included on the little TF card that came with this laser. That TF card allows you to work completely independent from the uh, computer. You can save, uh, you know, work on your, your design on uh, Lightburn, for example, and then save it as a G-code to the TF card and just carry the TF card over to the laser, plug it in, and hit the button and go. I'll show you that in a little while. But I do want to take the time to let you know that uh, Creality is sponsoring this video by giving me this laser. I'm not affiliated. I'm not going to receive an affiliate uh, commission. I'm simply showing you this laser and giving you my honest opinion on it. I mentioned the price point of this laser being lower than the last one I reviewed. And like I said, it's not quite as capable. Uh, max speed on this one is 10,000 uh, millimeters per minute. Which is plenty fast. I'm going to show you this thing going uh, at full speed in just a little bit. But one of the features... Uh, that Creality is uh, anxious to get out there is the stability of this machine. There's no movement. There's no bouncing around. There's no uh, jiggling or anything. It's very stable. It's very precise. And actually a little bit quieter than the other one. Something else I like about this machine is on the X and Y axis, you'll find millimeter increments. Nice for reference. So this is going at max power. Just take note of the machine itself. There's no instability whatsoever. I'll zoom out here for you. Also in the lower left hand corner of the machine there you'll see a leveling bubble. And that's pretty nice. Okay, so I've got a G-code on this little TF card. It just plugs right into that little control block right there. You hit the button once and it uh, gives you the frame. 
hit it again and it starts to engrave or cut whatever you've uh, told it to do on the TF card. Hit the button again, you can pause it, hit it again to restart it. And all of this is without being hooked up to the computer. Just cutting out a little tea light candle holder here uh, without air assist. You can see all that scorching. And I'm just letting it go here because it's kind of fun to watch. And here I'm just pointing out the uh, the air assist tube. Just a rubber tube goes all the way back to the little air pump. And you can see the difference there. There's no scorching whatsoever. You can hear the air blowing on there too. So if you get one of these and you're going to do a lot of cutting with it, uh, you definitely are going to want the air assist. Those results speak for themselves. Uh, just a couple other fun projects. Uh, you're limited to your imagination with these tools. While these are going, I want to reiterate the fact that uh, Creality is sponsoring this video, but I am not an affiliate of Creality. I will not be receiving a commission if you decide to buy one of these. I'm just providing you the information. I do like this machine. I'm very happy with it. I'd like to thank Creality for sponsoring this video. You'll be seeing more of this knife and others like it in a future video. I want to thank everybody for watching this video. And to all my subscribers that, uh, that may think I've given up on actual woodworking, just not the case. I'm going to get back to it uh, this week as a matter of fact. You can expect a woodworking video on Friday. But here's some food for thought for you. Look it up. It's important. Until next time, God bless and Semper Fi.